chant, when we chant the Om, or anything that we utter, anything that we speak through the sound, through the voice that we have, we can only speak at the exhalation. At the inhalation, you can't speak. The, the life force is going in, you can't speak. When you speak, the life force is going out, only then you can utter or create a sound. Yeah. So when we chant Om, of course you will experience Om because you're chanting at that time during the exhalation process. Yeah. Now this is when you are self-chanting through your own sound, through your own, own voice. You will experience the chant through or during exhalation only. Yeah. Then we enter into the second stage of Om, where we're not chanting the Om anymore. Now we are inwardly listening to the Om. Because what really happens when you, have you ever observed? When you chant something over and over and over again, it starts to vibrate within you. Even in your cellular system, it starts to vibrate. The moment you stop chanting, because the vibration of the chant of the Om in this case is still there, you inwardly start to hear the Om, because Om is still resonating inside. So in the second phase, you will start to hear Om without chanting. Now when you hear Om without chanting, it has nothing now to do with inhalation or exhalation. You will be able to hear, sense this vibration of Om in both in-breath and out-breath. If as a yogi, we practice that enough, then we enter into the third phase of Om. This is the mysterious phase of Om. Where even without the chanting, somehow you will start to feel, hear, experience the inward Om. The Nada. This is the third stage when you have touched the Anahad aspect of it. Unstruck sound of it. Yeah, I have a lot of friends who, who experiment with lot of Om or various kinds of chanting. After a time, when even they've stopped chanting for a couple of days, the chant keeps vibrating in them. When they're sitting in silence, in absolute silence, meditativeness, the sound, the Anahad is still heard inwardly. Lots of people experience that and they report. Yeah, It comes and goes. So again, when that happens, the third stage happens, then only you are, it is not dependent on in-breath or out-breath anymore. It almost could happen anytime. Will it stay? Will the anahat stay? Will depend on the practice. Yeah, but these are largely the three steps. I, I hope we're clear on that. Yeah?